Hello, I'm Penley the Penguin to give you some information about mathematics and some interesting information about penguins. Those of you who are penguin aficionados know that penguins porpoise or can porpoise when they swim. Porpoising is moving up and down through the water, above the water and going back in. What is the purpose of porpoising? Well, the purpose of porpoising is to travel a long distance because penguins have to breathe. So when they go up, they can breathe, and then they go down, and they go up and breathe, and they go down. And so they can, when they are swimming long distances, they tend to porpoise. We're going to use multiplication and division to solve word problems using symbols for the unknowns. What we do know in problem one is that there are 30 students who are going to the Science Museum. The cost is $3 per student, and we want to find the total cost. We will say T is the total cost. We know there are 30 students, and each student pays $3. To get the total cost, we're going to multiply 30 students times 3. And our total cost equals 3 times 0 is 0, 3 times 3 is 9. $90. Remember, T stands for the total cost. Example number 2. Nine runners completed a race. Altogether, they ran 36 miles. How far did each runner travel? Well, each runner travel, traveled a part of the 36 miles, and there are nine runners. So we're going to divide 36 by the nine runners to find out how far each runner traveled. Well, we're going to look for the, when we say how far or something, we could call that D or the distance they traveled. So 36 divided by 9 runners, 36 miles divided by 9 runners, gives you how far each runner traveled. And that would be 4 miles. We divided the 36 miles by the 9 runners. And why do I know this? Because I am Penley the Penguin.